The New York State Department of Transportation is building a diverging diamond interchange on Winton Road at I-590 in the town of Brighton, a suburb south of Rochester, New York. This interchange is the first of its kind in New York State and is an innovative method to efficiently and safely move large volumes of traffic through an interchange. The diverging diamond interchange operates as two one-way streets and traffic crosses over to the left side of the roadway at the traffic signal. To help familiarize you with this new traffic pattern, this video will provide a virtual driving experience of what it's like to proceed through this new traffic pattern, how to drive it, how to bike it, and how to walk it. Let's look at a video to simulate what you'll see as the driver. You'll be driving north on Winton Road, starting at the intersection at Meridian Center and progressing toward French Road. Notice the right lane to French Road. Notice the raised island. Notice the overhead guide signs that will tell you which lane to be in, which will be the same as before. Notice the extended lane dedicated to traffic headed north on I-590, an improvement to the existing bottleneck. As you approach the intersection to cross to the left, you will encounter a traffic signal. In this video, you see a red light showing southbound motorists proceeding through the intersection. Notice the raised islands, traffic signals, and signs, the pavement markings, the subtle curvature of the road, and the traffic separators. If you want to go left onto I-590 southbound toward I-390, stay to the left, as you do now, and bear to the left. This will be an unopposed left-hand turn, a benefit of the diverging diamond interchange. If you want to continue on Winton Road, proceed in either lane to the other traffic light to cross back over. The beauty of this traffic pattern is that it shifts two directions of traffic temporarily to the left side of the road for a simple, free-flow left turn onto the on-ramp, providing easier access to I-590. These vehicles are shown exiting I-590 at Winton Road, turning left onto Winton Road south toward Henrietta. Notice the double left turn lanes, the same as there are now. Notice the three travel lanes going south. Stay in the left hand lane to get back onto I 590 North, another unopposed left hand turn. Or to continue straight, cross over to the right on the green light. Notice the left lane to French Road, as there is now, and the driveway entrance to the Jewish Home Campus on the right. The diverging diamond interchange design is friendly to bicyclists and pedestrians. Depending on your comfort level, you can either travel along the white line, like this bicyclist here in the upper left, or use the multi-use sidewalk. Bicyclists using traffic lanes should obey the traffic lights. If you use the sidewalk, you should dismount before entering the crosswalks. If you would like to walk through the diverging diamond interchange, like this pedestrian in the upper left, there will be expanded multi-use sidewalks on both sides of Winton Road and marked crosswalks. If you want to cross Winton Road, you can do that at the traffic signals at Cambridge Place and French Road. Motorists should watch for pedestrians in the crosswalk. We hope this video helped you visualize what it will be like to drive through the diverging diamond interchange. The benefits include better traffic flow with easy decisions for the driver to make. Stop or go straight. Left turns to get on the expressway are free-flowing and unopposed, 
resulting in fewer backups on the Winton Road corridor and improved safety. For more information on this project, visit the project website at dot.ny.gov slash 590 Winton or email questions to 590 Winton at dot.state.ny.us.